actually mid thigh. I'm feeling all of it right now. But just to give you guys, I remember I mentioned those swans. Uh, we'll, we'll have video for that for you uh, later on that. But they are off of Wal Walnut Grove Road in their makeshift parking lot that they made. They're doing what swans do down the street here. Uh, but just want to tell you about how high this water is. You can see the stop sign. You can see the street sign here. I don't know. I don't know if that gives it justice in a sense. But as you mentioned, Eric, this is mid thigh deep as I walk towards you here. And what's not helping is that wind it is playing a huge factor uh, blowing in that water from Silver Creek back on to uh, Blackston Mill Road. Uh, when we first got here, uh, one of the officers from Clarksville PD told us that uh, it rose six inches since he had been sitting out here. And we can tell you since our first live shot, this water has has risen uh, at least another inch or two. And as you can see, I'm walking out of it. It, it recedes very quickly. That water from the, the Silver Creek uh, pushing its way uh, onto Blackest to the Mill Road. So um, again, as I mentioned before, this is just one of at least 60 roads in Southern Indiana uh, that, that are closed uh, this morning. Uh, so as you're waking up and if you got plans, if you're going to church, uh, try to figure out what your detour is going to be because it's not going to be easy, especially around this area for folks uh, who live here. It's, it's a lot of residential area homes around here. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, uh, for folks who are going to be waking up, they're going to try to figure out how they're going to get out of here. Uh, we know that uh, some more construction, or not construction, um, uh, working crews have come out and put up new barriers here uh, because, again, it keeps on rising. Uh, what about six or seven inches uh, since that officer had been here. He's been here overnight since it was raining really hard last night. So it gives you kind of a good idea of what the situation is here uh, as we continue to show you kind of how it's flooded out uh, these people's businesses. And, and, and the, the sad part about this is, yes, the rain is gone. But as Matt has been emphasizing and all of our, our good meteorologists there, uh, this is just the beginning. It's going to rise throughout the week uh, when we uh, see it uh, crest. It's supposed to crest today.